In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a basic dissection of an ostracod. This ostracod has already um, gotten its valves removed and it's been through the ethanol rehydration series and then placed into 70% glycerol uh, final. So I'm sorry, it's going to be a tiny bit out of focus. So the idea in dissection is that you want to get, sorry, that's where it's going. You want to get the limbs off as close to the body as possible. So I'm going to start here. here we go. The second antenna. All right, so here is our second antenna and with it actually came stuck to it. So those two are going to have to get separated out before I put on the cover slip. So let me get off the other second antenna if possible. Okay, tore it a little bit unfortunately. This is a pretty old animal. I think it was in ethanol for so I am expecting a little bit of tissue damage. It was in ethanol for like 10 years. So it's kind of a while. It's a little bit grody, but it's pretty okay. Like it's going to work for our purposes today. Most of the animals you get shouldn't be quite that old. All right, there we go. So we have our, um, so you can see them. Here you go. One second antenna, two second antennas. Now often at this point, you're actually going to take one of these second antennas and put it back into ethanol. That's if you're gonna extract DNA. So if you're doing the morphology project, you're gonna keep one of these second antennas. Okay. So we have second antennas. We have, uh, I think it's a mandible. I can't quite tell from this far away and I only get one eyepiece when I'm doing it on the camera. So now I'm gonna try taking off the purple claw. really stuck on here good. Let's have it. There it is. Okay, so here is the purple claw. I'm going to put that aside. And I'm going to go for the rest of the head. Get off the second antenna, or the first antennas rather. So here's one first antenna along with the um, median eye and the Belonchi organ. So here's the, oh you can't see it, hold on, let me move it into, there we go. So you see that little dark spot um, right there? That's the median eye and then um, there's a long skinny, let's see if we can get that in there. There's a long skinny thing sort of attached to it the very tip of it. Oh, it's very hard to see um, from here. It's the Belonchi organ. Okay. Let's get this frame here. Move these little guys out of the way. Alright, so I'm getting off the other first antenna. There it is. Now both the first antennas are off. Here you can see that while it's getting off the purple claw, I also got off the seventh limb. All right, there's the seventh limb, the vermiform appendage. There are two of these. So I need to get off oh, the other one, which is right here. There it is. So now I have my two seventh limbs off. All right, and so now I just need to get off the mouth pieces. Uh, and all this stuff here. So notice that I'm trying to grab it as close to the body as possible so I get the full appendage. So I actually got a little extra body ball on it. I'm just going to cut that off. And I usually have a tissue next to where I am so I can, um, so I can get anything that I don't need uh, off pretty easily. Alright, so 
So this is looking pretty good. You can see that I'm like left with almost nothing at all. Just checking to see if there's any other stuff that's going to be easy to get off of here. Okay, so some more mouthpieces. You can see here. bit funky because it's on the older side but even if you get an old one you take it nice and slow and easy you can usually get at least one of each of the limbs if not everything okay so this looks pretty satisfactory this one I'm gonna pull apart a little bit so we can there we go so when we flatten it out it will look a little nicer everything better. This is looking pretty good. Now before I put on the cover slip, I'm going to make sure everything is nice and spread out but towards the center. Um, if I put it too close to the edge, it will fall right off the slide, which is not good. So you can see the edge of my um, drop of glycerol. Can you see it? There we go, now you can see it. So that's the edge of my drop of glycerol. So I want everything a little bit inside from the edge, but not on top of each other. Because when I press down the cover slip, things are going to move outwards. And I don't want all of my limbs to be on top of each other, or they'll be really hard to photograph and really hard to measure. So this is where I like it. I'm going to zoom out. the whole thing. Let me focus. There we go. Alright, so this is my spacing in my big drop of glycerol uh, before I put on the cover slip. Um, once I put on the cover slip, it's all ready to start taking photographs. Um, definitely when you're um, putting these down here, try to make sure that everything is uh, it already at more or less the angle that you're going to want to photograph it at. Uh, that's just going to help you later on so you don't have stuff at weird angles um, that's harder to look at. So you can flip stuff around right now um, and it's harder to do it later if you want um, if you want a better view. So for example, the second antenna I think will be happier for me to look at uh, this way. So I'm gonna flip that one over. And you'll like get a better picture of that the more of these pictures that you look at. 